Reggie Rock has a reputation for being one of the worst legendaries in the series. In most generations, it's ranked in NU, even PU. And I'm sure in Gen 9, if it returns, that'll be no different. But in Gen 3, this was actually a usable Pokemon. In Gen 3, the power level is much lower. And a Pokemon with base 200 defense, that's pretty great, you know? Uh, compared to Tyranitar, it has the disadvantage of not having Sandstream, but it has clear body, meaning it matches up well versus Intimidate Salamence. And just the sheer bulk, it can live a lot more hits. It can live fighting type attacks that Tyranitar can't. Earthquakes. J a lot of stuff. Dugtrio can't KO it. Regirock also has access to Explosion, which is really good. Allows you to take a hit and then trade with the enemy. Often meaning that Regirock KOs two Pokemon in a game. So here we've got a Regirock team with a Magneton Offense Core and a Suicune as a bit of a win condition alongside DD Salamence. I think this is a great way to use Regirock. This is a team by Kallus. Let's give it a whirl, folks. Let's see how it goes. We're gaming. Up against 1644 opponent. This is going to be rough. I'm currently 1598. Pretty high rated. So... The stakes are massive. We're going to T-Wave turn 1. I think it's a pretty good click here. Only thing that can really threaten Regirock from Salamence is Hydro Pump, which is a rare option. It's a good option, but rare. I'll simply go Mag here. This is no problem. We've eliminated Skarmory. Hopefully we can break through with our physical threats now. We're going to assume they got Metagross or Swampert, of course. To handle the rocks. We'll see how we can navigate that one. Incoming here might be the Salamence coming back. Threatening Fire Blast. Something like that. It's one of the most possible... Plausible things I've heard in my life. Just personally speaking. How about you? I did start the battle timer here. Now right here I'm tempted to go to my own Salamence just because... The enemy here is clicking either Earthquake or Fire Blast, surely. If they click Dragon Claw they're just better, I don't know. It's a plausible click, I suppose. And now I'm actually... I'm, I'd half want to go Regirock and T-Wave, but also... That has its dangers folks that has dangers associated with it i think i'll go suicune and click calm mind because then if they have metagross they'll probably go there and if they have blissey i can um i can start stacking up and honestly start snowballing i think i so hp grass plus then i calm mind i should live the subsequent one and rest up It's good Celebi, okay. This makes sense. Damn, a Suicune would have almost just won single-handedly if it was Blissey instead of Celebi. This is where Celebi's kind of good gamers. But what if I just take the... What if I honestly just take the Leech Seed and start spamming boosts? Is that better than just switching out here? Because this Suicune's chipped, it's, it's low, it's never really going to provide much defensively against Salamence with only Surf. I think now's my time to use Suicune. As crazy as that may seem. I really hope it's not Calm Mind Celebi. But if it is, I at least have like Explosion Snorlax. I'm going to go with my gut and just go, with this, go in with the Suicune here. We'll see how this goes. I think you can't mind again, you don't rest. In the back, it's, it's got to be like Metagross or something. So Giga Drain only has 8 PP, so he, they can only use it 4 times because of pressure. His Tar. And I'll Sleep Talk. Hopefully we get those Surf. We'll see how it goes. 
I do have a Metagross. DD, if you DD up, it could be problematic for me. Okay, I think I should calm mind, but it's no, it's dangerous. I'll I'll so I'll rest. Playing for crits he is. Goes for the Giga Drains. We can at least stall the Giga Drains. That's really good. And I've not gotten any... Have I gotten rest three out of three times? That kind of sucks. I would like to at least calm my end up if possible. Game. <laughs> That's what I get for running Talk Suicune. Every... I've never experienced this. Every single time. Hopefully it doesn't matter. I think I stand by going for this. This is absurdly... Uh, this is a real outlier. How many damn rests? That's the only thing. That, the only thing that doesn't do anything is rest. Carmine or Surfer both are favorable. This is a little insane. All right, man. That is such a damn bummer. I can't. I can't talk here. No way. The arrow is gonna rock slide. What's the last on these teams usually? Oh, the crit double edge really sucks. I think I need this Metagross health. I'll mash, it's, it's good into everything. This is going terribly. This is really unlucky so far. I think last is like Metagross. Or swamp it. So. I'm probably inviting that in. Man, this is... Unfortunate so far. It's okay though. I think I'm in an okay position. Oh, they go Salamence. I like that damage. And, you know, slightly awkward here, but... I'm thinking I go Reggie Rock. No, I, I think I'll keep Reggie Rock actually. It's pretty nice into um Tar and Arrow. Meta's too low now. Are they really gonna fire blast again? Seems a bit obvious for them. I'm gonna st okay they did. Alright. And my follow-up isn't great. I think I'll use the Snorlax. Let me uh, run some calcs. Let's see. So mix elements versus whatever my Snorlax is here. Something like this, I assume. We got how much defense? 190. Forgive me, gamers. So we're, we're taking this much from Brig. I'll curse up. Okay, this seems good. Earthquake. How much attack we have? 350. A lot of attack. This lines up. So, Shadow Ball, no. Got EQ again. Nice, that's really good. We didn't get flinched. The Snorlax is going to be really good. We can live anything and explode. Unless Aero flinches. That'd be dangerous to go for. Aero is like... Yeah, I think they need Aero to win. So, sh you shouldn't risk Aero here if you're the enemy, I think. They'll probably... Risk Salamence, it's low anyway. They'll just Brick Break or Dragon Claw with Salamence.
We'll have to see, gamers. We'll have to see. If we take out Aero, I think we're totally good. Because Aero applies a lot of pressure. If we take out Aero, we're fine. We can also clean with Salamence. Because we can just uh, outrun Aero plus one. Which is good. So they're actually risking arrow here. Maybe this is no, it wouldn't be. Why don't? Why wouldn't you use Salamence? Because if you take out arrow, I'm smooth sailing. I think. Maybe they don't expect um, self destruct. That's just so dumb. Like, why would you do this? Why would you even do that? I don't even understand. <laughs> Not to be salty, but like, I don't, just use your Salamence. It's low. Aero is your main form of offense here that cleans this game. Why would you risk it right now? Who is the, is someone good? I, whoever you are, if you're watching this, why'd you just do that? What is that? <laughs> okay. We chip it with, with Reggie Rock a little here. If they stay in Rock Slide, I don't even know. They'll be so dumb. They're probably exiting to Celebi. I can at least para the Celebi. I can't believe you. I think I just won off that. Wait, uh... Shouldn't you go Celebi? Well, the worst thing I can do is... Is Thunder Wave. I'm... I'm a little confused. I don't know. Maybe I'm not seeing something? There's something I'm missing? This is Mixed Salamis. What's the last? Probably... Yeah, it's a Rock Resist. Yeah, we got the boom. Ah. See, I like protect on mag for this for these situations, so I can um what would I rather cut? I don't know. I think toxic is better. This is rough. I think I just lose. Unfortunately. It's rough because I, I kind of need to Toxic Swamper to deal with it. We've got bulk on Salamence, I think. No, not even. Okay, I would modify these EVs in a moment. Okay, I'll take that. That's kind of what I was hoping for. Yeah, if I go Suicune, there's no way after the spike and stuff that I'm good. So if, if I just land this Toxic, I, I could, um, could be fine. I was lucky, but I mean, I got unlucky in many other situations here. So we'll see if it's like refresh. That would suck if it is, but what can you do? And I'm sweet and can kind of clean this because now arrow isn't even can't even flinch me anymore. It's parried. Is this um curse rest? Looks like it. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Weird game. I won. I guess I purely won off that fire blast, but there was a lot that went wrong earlier. I wonder if the. I mean, the Suicune RNG maybe looks worse than it actually was. 
Because, I mean, if I'm just surfing the Celebi, it doesn't really make a difference. But if I'm at least calm minding, uh, I could start snowballing. But they always had the arrow, which was going to force me out. I probably would never stay after resting versus the arrow. So, yeah. Would have at least liked to do a do a bit more than that. The, the um, Flinch and Snorlax sucked, but I guess they were down to sack arrow anyway. Oh, this is someone who knows me. Who is this? <laughs> you got revenge on me for my unhinged magneton switches the other day. Oh, I think I remember that from the from the last video. True. Yeah, they um the one I lost with uh Fari or something. I got it they did an insane mag double. Okay, see when the next one game is out. Sixteen twenty one's pretty good. Where are we on the ladder? One sec. Right here. But we're both at the same rating. How cool is that? Look at that. Alright. That game confused me a bit. The decisions confused me, but maybe there's stuff that I'm not seeing. If you're watching, enemy gamer, maybe comment down below. Let me know the thought process. Alright. See you in the next one. Alright, gamers, we're up against Metagross lead, and this is a situation where I would like to have counter on the Red Rock. I think you probably just go to Suicune. It's Gengar Gamers. I'm saying Gamers too much. Sorry, Gamers. And right here I could expect a Thunderbolt... ...or a Will-O-Wisp, potentially. I'm thinking about, honestly, Regirock and T click T-Wave. We can stomach the, the special attacks from this. I don't want to get burned on Snorlax. Oh, we got uh, paralyzed. That sucks a little bit. We'll check if they have a taunt. Oh, they go to a ground type. Oh, you crit me, you absolute piece. I would have... If I thunder wave that Gengar, it's so great. And now you get to have your Gengar. I'm upset about it. I'm really upset about the entire thing. This is not what I wanted, and it's... It's put me at a disadvantage in the game. You've really done me dirty. It's it's not great for me. I go Magneton, I suppose. And hopefully force you out, but I don't know. Because the, the enemy's a bit of an enigma. I just worry, did you go Doug or something? No way. You go Snorlax. It's an enemy Magneton squad. At least I don't have to worry about uh, Skarmory here, probably. Although it could be Skarm, Meg, Gengar. That could be th a thing. Oh dear. This is a Suicune moment. I think Suicune has to really carry. Suicune's got to carry this. Okay, with HP Grass, I guess you're probably not uh, Will-O-Wisp. It's probably T-Bolt, Ice Punch, HP Grass, and uh, Miscellaneous. Probably Explode, if I had to guess. You know? And are you going to explode right now? It's, it's one of the most possible explodes of all time. No! Oh gosh. Okay, we caught the exploit. We trade mag instead of trading uh, Suicune, which is good. 
I'll go Suicune to get our leftovers here. It's Earthquake. Is it Curse as well? You Okay. Don't know if there's any better trade than that. You're also going to blow up here, right? Oh, not quite. I like how this looks. That's a crit, oh god. No, this sucks. I, I lose now. Miss, miss, miss. Maybe it was never meant to be. You have to miss. That's the only way. Maybe I live in Ice Beam with the Salamence. Let me check if a um, Shadow Ball finishes. Like, if Earthquake is doing. Yeah, Shadow Ball, yeah. Oh, the Earthquake also finishes. Oh, damn it, man. And I just get frozen anyway. What an unlucky game in every... Uh, <laughs> that's just... Uh, I don't even see the point lost there. Let's just go again. What can you do, man? <laughs> okay, right here I'll just T-Wave. And that's a nice... That's a pretty nice T-Wave right there on Brelium. I think we'll take sleep on Sweek and we get sleep talk anyway. And then we'll go sell them. It's... Intimidate. I'll go. I'll go. Snorlax. We'll, uh, we'll curse. What's going on today? You you stay in versus Snorlax. You absolute genius. Wait, why would you stay versus sixteen thirteen? There must be a reason then. You got dog or something. Or you got no better. You got no better option. You don't have like a meta. You thought I would focus punch. Okay. I will I will once again curse. I'll just blow up, I suppose. That's an unfortunate I guess it could be a good trade. I got the Suicune and the Suicune can be Wink on now. So Okay, we'll go Salamence to Intim something. That's okay. I'll go Suicune and try to try to wake. I suppose we can. Let's, uh... This is interesting. Is he going to EQ? I'm going to go meta. I thought maybe Body Slam to, to play around at incoming Salamence, but I was wrong. I guess I'm now forced into blowing up. And then we, we take out the Snorlax. That's great. That's great. Mence again. I think that um, the enemy stinks versus Suicune here. I think it's a Suicune situation. HP Grass, wow. I'll, I suppose I'll sleep talk this time. Now I'll calm mind. I will rest. What if they focus punch like a genius? They would never. They were full parrot. And I, of course, hit the Surf, because I'm great. I can take a Focus Punch. They're full parrot again. It's just that easy, honestly. <laughs> what's what's going Okay, weird games today. I don't even know. Um, okay, if, I'm going to assume this is like DD with a bit of bulk or something. I'm actually modest, so the Surf should be... Pretty threatening here. Oh yeah, could chance to two hit. Sign me up. Oh, you're only your mixed mints. It's over. It's over. I guess I kind of looking at the team. I now understand the T bolt into the Snorlax. It's kind of the best thing you got. But this is the, therein lies the issue with teams like this, I suppose. And this last is a loss of Charizard. Okay, horrendous verse. Suicune here in this in this end game situation. Or right, back up to sixteen sixteen. We'll take that. That's beautiful. That's great. Reggie Rock is is doing stuff. Reggie Rock is is having a bit of a good time. 
Now this is epic right here. I, w w once again, we T-wave. One day I'm gonna get a Hydro Pumped. I'm gonna be furious about it. Alum. Well, I'm glad I know that now. I, I like to go Suicune in here. You can blow up if you like. If you're interested, you can blow up. I'll just surf, we'll test the waters. That's a mash attack race. You're gonna blow up. I won't, I won't try to play around it. We'll just let it happen. That's probably fine. I'll go Salamence to intimidate something. Intimidate Salamence, perfect. I'll go Snorlax here because they got a nerfed brick break so we can, we can now handle that. Maybe I should have gone to Magneton, but what if they have Skarmory and I lose my Magneton, then we're in a big trouble potentially. I'll Earthquake. We'll do it. Okay. Let me just actually import this, this Snorlax here. If the calking bores you, I don't care, folks. I'm a gamer. And we, we calc. The game is calc. It's what they do. I can curse once more, perhaps. What if I'm plus one Shadow Ball will two hit it in sand? Perfect. And Brick Break is now doing not enough to two hit in sand, right? Well, why is it doing so much? Wait a minute. Why is Brick Break doing that much? Oh, I was Dragon Claw, my mistake. Dragon Claw now. Now gets me. I'm ISF'd up. I have up. Although that was a max roll twice. 22 to 26. If one of them was just less than 25, I was fine, I think. That's two max rolls. That kind of stinks, doesn't it? Now I lost my Snorlax. That's really bad. Maybe I should have just blown up. I think I should have just blown up then. Avoid this situation. This Snorlax is going to be too low to do anything else anyway. Yeah, I should have just blown up. My mistake. Thought I could preserve it. To gain a tiny advantage by, you know, having him have to revenge kill it. Then I can respond, keep up momentum. Probably not worth the risk. Although, I don't know. This was actually kind of an outlier situation. I think. Well, then there's the plus. Okay, that was actually... That was a high roll as well. 28... Whatever, whatever, whatever. Let's just play. It's got to be T-Wave. Or does it? Because what if you have uh, Doug or something? Now just T-Wave. P2, okay. So they usually have T-Wave themselves. The, the P2s of the world. There it is, as 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 we expected. Oh, we could randomly. It did bizarre day today. What is happening? That was. Uh, I, I honestly, I apologize for that. That was stupid. We could tear wave you, and then. Well, now we're a slightly awkward spot, but... Yeah, I thought you might Dragon Claw. My incoming Salamence. So I go Metagross instead. Let's Rock Slide. I uh, maybe shouldn't reveal that we have that. Maybe a bad play. Okay, Charizard. I think I need to... Preserve Metagross for Tyranitar, right? So I'm gonna go here and I'm gonna explode. Oh crap. I can't really rock slide there because they can sub and eventually I full para. But uh, if they sub, they, they kind of suck here. Okay, we can um, we can DD. Or should I actually just attack? No, I'll DD. Oh wait. I think I win. 
I'll DD again because then I can um No 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 Oh my gosh. Callus has weird order of the moves. He orders them alphabetically, so I'm just having hidden power flag here because it's like the stab I have at first. I just accidentally clicked earthquake. That would have I would have screamed. I mean I could miss rock slide, I suppose. I think we'd still have a good chance with the meta. GG. 1630? Where's that? Oh yeah, almost top 10. Almost top 10 with Reggie Rock real quick. Let's do it. I'll see you in a moment. When Wii Sports title theme comes on, you know it's a serious situation. You know it's a big moment. When Wii Sports title comes comes on the on the orcs. We've done the Skarmory, we've done it. It's a flag on. I might just toxic it. Oh, this could be Superman, which I think is a pretty good matchup. Oh, they would be 244 minimum, so probably a bad idea to. Doesn't wouldn't Superman get totally destroyed by Swigger? Unless they have Zap. They need Zap. If they have Zap, um, then I just go Snorlax, we curse. They must be clicking EQ. I'm so tempted to go Salamence, but I think Sweet Green's the safer. I'm, I'm tempted to just rest here. I think they're going straight to Sweet Green. If they have it. But if I Calm Mind, I win if they don't have Zap Dose. Like, on the spot, I win. Oh, it's Celebi. I might do the same thing I did last game and just use this Sweet Green right now. Take the Leech Seed. Not last game, a few games ago. Because if this is their best, then I, I'm snowballing past this Celebi eventually in a... And I become a bit tough to deal with. This might indicate, like, no Blissey, right? If I throw out a Surf or something... I thought, like, they might go Tar to make sand and to catch me resting or something. So just throw out a Surf. Didn't work, but that's fine. We'll rest now. They do have HP Grass, which is a little tougher to deal with. We'll, we'll take the 1 in 3 to kill Tar. That's a good deal. We're again hitting rest every time. Maybe it's a bad idea, I don't know. Because I got meta for the tar. That's fine. I might need this for the Flygon. That's the problem here. I might need this Suicune for the Flygon. It's so much nicer when they have Giga Drain. Because they, they can only Giga Drain you four times and it's destroyed. And maybe the, I have to exit now. I think I should exit then. We'll go Salamis here because we... They have to HP Grass, right? They have to fish for the crits. We'll preserve this this weekend. We'll preserve it, even though the spike and sand is up. I don't love I don't love playing for the crit dodge. They got what uh, seven chances to crit from here. Don't love that. So I'll go for the HP fly. And meta looks solid. Teams like this can suck it. If you're running Flygon Rock Resist, you can stink versus Metagross. They need something for Metagross in the back. I'm just going to mash to see. It is Charizard. Okay, I could nail this with Rock Slide later in the game. That's really nice to know. And this is intriguing. I think I'm going to go Salamence once. Hmm. How do you handle this? I'm thinking go Salamence once, and Tim them, go Snorlax. No, I'll, we'll just go straight to Snorlax. I think that'll be fine. And they gotta exit here, they gotta... Unless they're crazy, they focus punch. It's possible. I think it's worth the Earthquaking here, 100%, because... Um, we chip this, then DD Mens can sweep. With just one Dragon Dance, they're going to Earthquake. And right here, do you even explode? Paving the way for Suicune? I don't think so, actually. I think no. I'll Shadow Ball.
This is this is a weird one. I got a crazy idea to curse and then earthquake the incoming Tyranitar. I think what it, should I just click explosion? No. Yeah, I'm getting way too low. We'll just explode. Whatever. I think that's fine. I think that's totally fine. And this is. I might just go Reggie Rock and click explode too. Because they probably go Flygon. And then we trade with the Flygon and then Mens is about to clean. The only problem is Tar, but then we... If we get meta in on Tar, we rock slide the incoming Zard. They 100% go into Zard. It's their only recourse. And then meta might be the sweeper. Alright. I'll go Reggie Rock. I'll rock slide. They're probably going to HP Grass. No problem. And then we can just... Does this just explode? Look at that value added out of Regirock. That's insane. This is interesting because I might need Meta's Boom for the last, but I, I don't know. Probably not. We'll mash here. Or is it EQ2 hit safer? I'll probably mash. Will EQ now, it's more accurate. Maybe EQ2 hit was better. But we didn't know the the full story there. And this we can actually in Tim spam this, so that's good. Oh we just Or we could just blow up and win. 1638, what are we at? I just hit top ten with uh Look at that, ADV Brian in the top ten. Look at that, wait a minute. We're back in the we're back in the conversation, folks. We're back in the conversation. We're top ten. Let's go. Let's keep going, Reggie Rock. Reggie Rock's great. Look at this. Look at the results. The results don't lie, do they? People think of my videos I'm exaggerating. Oh, you can't use anything in Gen Three, Jim. Look at me, Reggie Rock. We're top eight. We're top eight on the planet. There's it's been a bit of unclean games, a bit of weird situations, but hey, you can't say I'm. Um, you can't say I'm not backing up my words with facts and logic. You can't say it. You can't even try to say it. We're back. And you know that when Munbo's hot Benjo Kazooie comes on, that it's a special moment. And you're going to T-wave, of course. We all know that when Munbo's hut comes on, that's when the real gaming begins. And we have T-waved the zap and it's... It's taken 95. It's taken an, an impressive 95% from Reggie Rock. This is lovely. I love that exchange. That's That it feels like a big advantage early on. I think I'll blow up here in case of sub or calm might. You know? Uh, one of the greatest Jirachi owners in the game is Earthquake Snorlax. One of the few things that's just super, super solid versus Rachi. The only thing is like Fire Punch Burn. So, I think you know what's happening. We go curse. If there's a scum, we force it in right now. And then we go mag and it's over. Wait, it's in fact a Paragon 2. What a world. Now that's interesting. Is Paragon 2 gonna T-wave us? I think I don't care. I think I'll just curse up in its face. It can't do any damage to me. This is gonna be a problem for my enemy. Dari Master Ren. They're in trouble. You're in big trouble. That's a two hit threat, but I will curse up instead to increase my damage on the subsequent earthquake. Of course, I've been full parrot. Reducing my odds of success, but I like the, I think the Snorlax is well positioned right now. This mag could find a full parrot here, but I'm bulky enough to take these T-bolts. I'll just, oh, metal sound. Interesting. Interesting. I think I still Earthquake. That's an interesting way to handle this. It might work, in fact. I think we one hit with Shadow Ball from here. I'll take a bit from Psychic, but I'm happy to just click Shadow Ball if we can eliminate this. Nice.
and hmm. That sucks, but uh, that's like the I've gotten a lot of the Snorlax. Can't really complain. Can't really complain. Revenge with the Salamence. It's probably going P2. That's fine. Uh, so I'm assuming last move is T-Bolt. That's what we assume here. So I wonder. P2 T-Bolt. Is it that threatening after a... No, but you're going to... The problem is you're going to T-Wave here. Hmm. So I can't do the faster Carmine quite... And then there's Mag as well, which is a is a problem for many. What's the last? It's a weird squad, but it's looks like a new player trying to build around P2 with the Dugweeks. So last could be like Raikou or... I mean, structurally you need a Rock Resist, but could be another P2 synergy, right? I think I will just go Mag and take the uh, stomach the... Oh, this is great. Right here, I'll just Toxic. Oh, should I Thunderbolt? No, I'll Toxic because I'm afraid of T-Wave. If I Toxic you, I'm, I'm in a great spot because then you are on a clock and uh, Salamence can very easily clean up. Let me just quickly calc some damages against uh, Jirachis. Various Jirachis. Against normal Jirachi plus one EQ is a one hit. I mean, um, no bulk Jirachi, not normal Jirachi. Normal Jirachi would be more like... Maybe it's sub-CM, because that would make sense. They need some pressure on... Various. Oh, this is a good opportunity for Suicune. I might just start snowballing with Suicune and go in. Oh, they got raw. Okay. But they're on a clock. I don't think they can fit refresh in this case. We'll just surf now. Oh, it's Endeavor. What? Surf Roar, that adds up, I suppose, yeah. Okay. Well, now Suicune can't really... This is interesting. I think I gotta go Metagross. Is this Fire Punch? We can, we don't get too hit by Fire Punch, just, I think, based off vibes. How, what's the... Not actually that bulky here. Okay. HP... Fighting? The only thing I think of is HP fighting. Because uh, what, um, it was like HP water or something weird. Could be HP water. Didn't I see a team with HP water on it? In my stream? I think I saw that. Well, um,. I almost want to preserve this meta. Want me to refresh my memory here. We're doing 31 with EQ, so I feel like MASH is going to do a lot right now. Do you think the mag is coming in? On Toxic? I think it is. If Mag uh, T Bolt is more that is good enough damage anyway. Against against self. Uh huh. HP fire is a bit more, yeah. I'll use HP fire. Alright, good damage there. It's clearly hidden power random, so... I think we're okay. And if I just explode after this, so I think we just win. Because I just follow up and KO whatever. Mag can't one me hit me from here. Yeah, you can't one hit me. And then I will blow up, no problem. One of the easiest victories of all time. Not really. <laughs> The Jirachi could have been a problem if it was a different set, but... 
I'm only saying Hidden Power Water because someone on my stream sent me through a team with HP Water on it. That's just had me thinking of that. Which is an interesting option. It hits like Fires plus uh, Tyranitar. It's actually not bad. It's got some merit. I just wonder if that's what this is. I think it's... This was a similar team. 1644. My peak rating, folks, is 1698 or something like that. 1698 when I hit rank 1. Something along... Or it might be 1670 something. But hey, we're number 7. Look at that. 1644. I'll just keep going. I'm just having fun, really. I'm just having fun. Oh, look, it's Mead. We're up against Mead, folks. May the best gamer win. I wonder... I wonder what Mead's using here. Will Mead play around Mag? We'll see. Mead might get me. Mead's pretty good. Mead didn't. Mead has failed to do it. But many also would. That's fine. I'm probably just T-bolting this, I think. Hey, I'll just T-bolt this. Oh, it's fast. That's max, uh... That's max speed Tyranitar. Interesting. Jolly, must jolly DD. Must be. Hmm. Means probably Lumberry. We go Metagross. Check if you have a Swampert blur it in here. If you got Swampert, you'd probably go in there. You wouldn't stay here. You have Metagross as the Rock Resist of choice. Well, I got my attack raise. I feel like I've cheated this. Now I can just EQ you. I'm probably faster. This is a speedy Metagross here. Let me import this Metagross, in fact. The custom Callus Metagross. A much more aggressive version of the more standard Protect set here. Plus one EQ. Is doing a lot. I'm actually... I'm gonna... Problem is that I become vulnerable to Tyranitar if I... I'll meet left. Wait, I, I won't start timer. I'll meet rejoins. Let me check the damage of, of mash mop defaults. Yeah, it adds up. So... Hmm. But the I could, problem is I don't have a great Metagross switch in either. I'm actually myself pretty threatened by Metagross. I feel like... I have this opportunity to do this big EQ, I gotta go for it. I'll probably click Rock Slide here to finish it off just because it's a bit more accurate than Mash and I don't want to click EQ again. Could lure stuff in. Alright, here's Salamence. Likely threatening Fire Blast. Which is a problem, or perhaps. I think I should let it happen. Plus mischance, of course. Explode was the better click, I think. No, it wasn't. I, would, I was still at 47. I want to preserve the health if, if in the event of a miss. So right here, I'm thinking Snorlax Curse is a, maybe a good play. But it's interesting. Suicune Carmide could be the way. Let's just see our Calx versus uh, Mixed Mence. So we're just this... We are this set... Uh, huh. Okay. I almost don't want to... What if I just go Snorlax? I... No, Regirock. Regirock's the play. Regirock's way better. I think I can tee... I don't think you would have meta. There's a chance of Doug. Doug is there's a chance, but I don't think you would have Swamp it. Oh, it's Claydol is also... It makes sense, yeah. Okay. Do I preserve Regirock and go Suicune? It's possible. Regirock's actually really good here. Because, like... I think Regirock will 1v1 the tar unless they hit a... Flinch, which is unlikely. I think i go Suicune. And Claydol could explode here, but I think I'm happy with, for that to happen. Okay, Blissey. I wonder if it's, um... I think we'll go in with... With, the, with all this. Yeah, I was thinking, what if it's T-Bolt, but... Oh, it's, it's a car mine. Oh, dear. Okay, car mine bliss here is crazy.
Curse is probably safe once. At least I still have this weaker to check clay all decently. Uh huh. This is very interesting, folks. I think I have to explode. And then I, I damn lose. I almost lose here. This is such an issue. Yeah, I have to explode. I think there's no way around it. Because what else is the option? What other option is there against this? I'm going Mens on the Brick Break, Reggie Rock on the Dragon Claw, explode, hope that they stay. Preserve lax, it's low anyway. No, no, no. You gotta blow up. Absolutely. Okay, wait a minute. Now what? We know this is Jolly Lob Tar, probably. So I may go to Elements and actually Dragon Dance. I think I lose to the Claydol is gonna blow up. Maybe use Reggie Rock here instead of Salamence. I can then blow up afterwards. Yeah, I like that. Go Reggie Rock and just click uh, EQ. They can EQ me, but I live and then uh, I can blow up on something. We have to blow up, I think. Oh, we can go Sweet Green now. No, I can't ever bring this back in. It will be dead. I think it's got to be blow up. Or is it? Wait a minute. This is very interesting because uh, I think I saved the Reggie Rock. This is effed. I think I would lose. I can't win, really. If I exploded this, that would have been so good. And I probably win. No, not quite. Because the, the Blissey just sweeps. Yeah, that was a good play. Because if I explode, the Blissey wins. If I explode, the Blissey wins. I can't go straight to Reggie Rock. I take too much. This Suicune sucks anyway, but I was I was hoping it at least does stuff to Claydol maybe. But it's that's never gonna happen. This sucks anyway, so I actually guess I should just um. Oh, this is interesting. I think I have a weird idea. Oh, I can actually rest now maybe. That's lucky. My idea is like. I already forgot. Because <laughs> now I'm, a, I'm in a different world where I've rested on my Suicune, so this changes things. But I was thinking of something else. It was like... I can't even remember. <laughs> Whatever, we're in a different world now. Let's, let's make it happen. Okay, this is weird. Should I play for this? No, no way. I go Reggie. Reggie creeps bliss. Maybe. Which means that I can't intim the Claydol because he will switch out last. I will switch in first, intim the bliss, and then he'll go Claydol. So I can't minus one the explode and maybe live the explode. That's impossible. 
But what about... There's no way I win. I can't go for this 1v1. It's too bad. Right? I think I have to do Regirock. But Regirock is so bad into Claydol. That's the issue. But then how do I ever break Blissey? No, I can't ever break Blissey, right? Is men slow? No. I think it's got to go. I got to. I can never play for this. And I, I just have to explode, I think. Mead's probably going to go Claydol. Or Salamence. We went Salamence last time. Oh, have you guys What if I just rock slide the Salamence? What if I T-Wave? Because if you try to sack Salamence, I T-Wave it. And if you go Claydol, I plus explode anyway. It's the same. Well, now I can go Salamence if I want. Now this is getting weird. Okay, I'm going to go Salamence. And... Going Salamence puts him in his tough spot. Because he either has to blow up here, which was, is kind of weird, because then I can maybe blow up... I could mind the game with Regirock. Because it's 50-50, I blow up on Bliss, win, or I Reg rock slide Salamence, also win. But now, things are weird. If he blows up here, I don't even think he KOs. But he has to go Blister to live the... Let's see this. I think I'm just this set. Why does it default to HP flying always? It's stupid. I think he just goes Blissey. Ah. Oh. Wait, what? Hmm. Wait a minute. What are you doing here? There's something here I'm not seeing. You're earthquaking. You're happy to trade Claydol to allow Blissey in? What if I DD up, though? You thought I was mixed, maybe, and this would guarantee that I can't brick break Bliss, but then... Now you know I'm DD for sure. Is, is that what you thought? Oh, it's unlikely. I'm probably DD if I have Mag. He probably thinks I'm never... Okay, well, why wouldn't you Psychic? Did you think I'm trying to reg go Regirock on your Bliss to try and do a Boom Mine game? Maybe that's what it was. Oh. Well, now I think I'm, I'm in a good spot because I can... Uh, Regirock is well positioned. Regirock is really good now. Guess I'll... I was all Dragon Dance in case you like missed something. So now, okay, Regirock can live everything you do, right? Right? Yes. Correct. And Rock Slide KOs for certain. I think I T Wave because I can then Para Flinch this if it comes to that. Ha. Huh. I was just Rock Slide. I th am I faster than Blissey? If I'm faster than Blissey, I just won. I'm faster than Blissey. Or is it speed time, maybe? Oh, I'm faster. Wow, how did that even... I don't even... I'm a little bit confused about the why he was earthquaking with the Claydol. I think maybe he just made a mistake. He assumed Regirock didn't have this speed creep. Because this is a bit of speed creep for Blissey. So maybe he assumed I'm slower than Blissey. He can finish me off on 1v1 Suicune as the end game, But I'm faster on the Regirock. He probably just didn't know that. Alright, 1665. Honestly, we're going to leave it at that. What an incredible performance. I didn't expect... I didn't expect such a performance.
with Reggie Rock, honestly. But look at that. That's like almost 100% win. I think I got one unlucky game, and that's it. We're number five. Incredible. Amazing. See you later. And of course, as always, thank you to Brian. Goodbye. <laughs>